must be some switch in a nearby yard or or else we wouldn't see that fancy uh we wouldn't see that fancy little cut sequence <laughs> all right you know guess the fourth wall can go fuck itself one two three Piss off, would ya? Ow. Okay, where are you? Boom. See? Job's, job done. Moving on. Oh no, I'm on 124 frames. Whatever will I do? Bit of a drop from that 300 we were seeing earlier, but you know what? I think I can live. I would like to be recording this in like 1080, but there was freezes happening early on a bit in 1080p. Uh, so I think I have to record in 720. Still, it's HD, it should be good enough, but I'll have to step down. Where are you, you fucking cunt? Basically, folks, what really pisses me off is some gif from a distance throwing fireballs at me. So if you know what gets my butt up, so, you know, if you don't want to get pissed me off, don't be doing that to me, folks. Alright? Alright. There's that there, there's that. <clears throat> I could probably fling myself onto it in all honesty. Especially if I got up there. Ooh, that just opened. Oh, that was handy. I was waiting for it to just shut on me. Seal me in here, turn enemies gang up and just rush in. Scorpion around here somewhere. Maybe inside this place? Ooh, sound cut out for a moment there. They're gone. I like how I can kill those bastards in one, one nice shot. Very handy. Don't like wasting a type around on uh, the fireballs, but you do what you have to. Okay, just die, would you? Thank you. Where's the next one? Yeah, I kind of like this skybox. It looks much nicer. Maybe a bit too still. The clouds aren't moving enough, but whatever. Ooh, armor. Howdy. Just kind of waiting for a secret to be found there. I uh, know, it just, um, after the secret bombs mutated thing. Uh, I'm just I was expecting another one up here. moment I thought I saw blood on the statue, like, you know, exploding it had made it bleed. Which would certainly be something now, wouldn't it? And what's out here? Oh, this is the part with the minigun. Robert. Come on, play with me now. <laughs> On a harpies. Let's uh, introduce him to our minigun. It's not the size, it's the frequency. Also, the wing clipping. So, what? Uh, that's it? <laughs> kind of expected a little bit more.
So, does this just open? Got my hopes up. Hmm. All right. And now, kill tree. And now, statues. You never know what you may destroy, may find you something. Or maybe even destroying it will cost you something. So, you never know. Basically what I'm saying is, kill, crush, destroy. Yeah, not words to live by. I think those are actually lines from a song. <sighs> One from Power... Um, not power evil, uh, dream evil. Okay, come on. Or maybe I'm thinking, uh, paraphrasing them and inserting my own phrase. Uh, I think maybe I'm taking two words from them and slapping in my own one for the third one. Instead of kill, crush, destroy, maybe it's kill, burn, be evil. You know, maybe that's it. Actually, yeah, I think that's the line. I think that might be it. But anyway. <laughs> Bad news. We'll need to go now from the search for this one. Good news. My sensors located it in the, located one in the yards nearby. Now the official version. In order to open the door with the elephant statues ar around, Siri uh, Sam Siri Stone must visit a nearby yard and pick up the statue of a golden elephant. That way he'll be able to go into the next yard. Excerpts taken from the from Siri, uh, from SSSE official strategy guide. That is hilarious. I don't remember what I was saying there. Yeah. My mind just blanks. <sighs> My mind just blanks so goddamn much. It's actually really unnerving. Shouldn't be this goddamn forgetful. I'm only bloody twenty. Never want me to remember nuclear launch codes. It'll be like, wait, I ha I knew nuclear launch codes. Oh shit! <laughs> okay, one lot more time. Sorry, I thought it saw sparkles over that side. Let's got to try it again here. No, I I didn't stand. And away we go. Okay, game. I I know where to go. I was literally just there. Guess that's in case you kind of just skip there. Because unless they put up like invisible walls there, you could probably fling yourself off and get down here. Rocket jump. I've gone further with rocket jumps. Oh, well, that's creepy. Boom. Kill. Kill. Thank you. Oh. I was kind of expecting another one. Ah, fuck. Um. Another one of the fireball bastards over there. There you are. Should always expect a back attack. A back above attack. Die. 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 So, anyone else want to make an issue of this? Oh, you do, huh? Anyone else? Any takers? Anyone at all? No one? Good. I already did it. I'm just glad I had the minigun out. Yeah, I'm just glad I, I had the minigun out. That would have ended a lot uh, worse for me otherwise.
Huh. I wonder if I can get all the loot. The, there was like a bit of loot up there I didn't get. I wonder if I can get it. Despite falling down here. Ow! Okay, let's... Whoa. Shit. Okay, never mind. Uh, I don't think there's... I don't think I can. But I think it was only like those um, 10 health vials. Well, correction. Uh, two vials of 10 health. Hey, die! Thought I killed you. Okay, let's try a rocket jump. Bastard. Okay, I can, can get up there with a rocket jump. But the enemy will knock me right back down. Better off provoking it, killing it, then going up. There we go. That was worth it. Seriously. Dumbass. Seriously, this was goddamn worth it. Analyzing. Uh, approaching courtyards. Great, we found our way to the sacred courtyards of Gilgamesh. This is a part of the city wh wh which is, guess what, full of temples dedicated to our friend Gilgi. Only sacred people and high priests lived here and performed uh, their daily rituals and other stuff that sacred people usually do. But not about history. We don't have time for chit-chat. Let's enter the courtyards of Gilgamesh. I not done in here. That was the way you have to go. You can kind of skip a bit ahead of it though if you want to. That's what I'm saying. That's the way you're meant to go. But you can you can if you are good with rocket jumps or acknowledge your existence at the very least, you can skip it. Skip up to it. Okay. Hmm. Piss off. Hmm. Seems the game just like you coming back to content you've skipped. Or like running away from other stuff. Takes issue with it. Just seems weird to just have like a trail of enemies just following me. Being right goits. Hey. I couldn't stand on that. Why should you? Can this door open? Seemingly not. And yeah, it seems like I got back to where I... I got dropped down there. God damn, there's a lot of these. I think that's the most I've seen at one time. Yeah, and all these have spawned in now. When I originally ran through here, there's none there. But I triggered it all when I reached some point back there. That is strange. That is weird as hell. Okay, so... And nice around here. A bit of armor. It's useful, but some nicer. Let's die. Thank you. Oi. Piss off. Wonder if I'm gonna have to go fight Gilgamesh next. That would be interesting. I don't have a cannon. Wait, minigun. I'm out of minigun ammo. Like, we have to fight, uh... Cuckoo Khan. So maybe we'll have to fight, um... Gilgamesh. Hands itchy. It's not that much of a jump. Wonder what he'll be like, though. 
Cuckoo Khan, the Wind God, was, you know, Red Wind. He had a lot of beans, you know. Um, wonder will Gilgamesh be like some giant warrior guy or what? If you vaguely remember reading a bit of the G epic of Gilgamesh, and uh, Gilgamesh was like uh, quite a bit of a tyrant at the start, and the gods, uh, at the behest of some mortals praying to them, uh, make another guy who can match Gilgamesh, who can you know test him kind of thing, um, because he's a demigod and everyone else is mortals so who you know can't match him in power or whatever. So you make this other guy, and unlike Gilgamesh, who's you know in the city and whatnot, this guy's growing up in nature, and being raised by animals. And the guy one day is out, and he finds him, and he is like, "There's a kid being raised by animals, or a guy being raised by animals." Huh? Let me go hire a prostitute to lure him away. Yeah, and he hires a prostitute to lure him away, and does so, and I think they have sex. She tells him about the city, he wants to go see it. Yeah. So they go see it, and the rest, uh, that's pretty much it. All I've read of it. I skimmed the rest. I think of the book still lying around somewhere. Just have to get around to reading it. Any little gubbins over here? Secret door unlocked. What secret door is that, though? I didn't see a secret door, so it's just a case of... Like, well, shit, there's a secret door? It's possible that it's back inside there, but I know. It's probably around here somewhere. Maybe it's this place? It's not really secret now, is it? We expect it more hidden. Oh, that was something. Shit. Have some fire. Okay. Just die. Barely got anything out of that, and now I've pretty much lost it all. Bastards. Boom. Boom. Goits. Eat minigun. Heal. Alright. For a moment I thought one of the walls looked different than the others, like it was a fake wall kind of thing. If you put a bolt in it, you could go, you know, to disappear, or touch off and disappear. Of course. Akbar, where were you? Where are you when I need you? Hey, where are you going? Don't have a party without me. Oh, don't worry, Sam, they won't. At least they're all filtering in this way. For now, at least. They might start filtering in another way, but I'm gonna focus here. So otherwise this happens, and it gets a lot more chaotic. Really? I was kind of expecting them to eventually start, you know, go in for you that way, like that rises up and they start trying to attack me from both sides. The fact that that didn't happen is strange. I was kind of hoping that we consider a secret just because I'm obsessive, you know, I want to get them all kind of thing. And I only got 3 out of 13. Oh, shite. Also, I finished it 